you wondered what Ghana would be like if it was underpopulated? Well, Spanish politicians are worried about the country's failing birth rate. It has therefore appointed its first minister of sex, whose job will be to get people busy between the sheets to try and reverse the population decline. Here in Ghana, the story is different. If you were the president of Ghana, what kind of ministry would you set up to control high procreation rate? Ministry of Special uh, Presidential Special Initiative and, and, uh, and Assess Control. I'll be dashing few condoms and ensuring that and making sure that okay, fine. Uh, basically a few contraceptives and all that, uh, but it would it would not be on force. It would be basically to who whatever you prefer that you think it's it's best suit you. That's what I'll let you take. But then I would also encourage people, you see. Parents should basically be able to live within their means and ensure that you're able to manage and take care of your kids. It's about getting the experts to be in the population council to plan and control, give the expert advice what they have to do to reduce the population, educating the people, doing the right thing, giving them the right information they use because people still believe having a lot of kids is like they are having fortunes. It's nature. We don't have to... Um, deliberately uh, uh, establish a ministry to reduce our population. We should manage our resources as well, not to uh, set up a ministry to, with the aim of uh, reducing population. I think education, more of, of um, education will do, like um, educate the public on how to probably manage um, sex life. So they don't probably have a lot of kids of, of that sort. Yeah. Which ministry will do the education? Um, is it the ministry of gender or whatever first? All right. Yeah, yeah. So you won't set up a ministry? No, no, I wouldn't do that. All right. So Barry Makubaji says, I won't do that job because I don't decide when people decide to do the, this thing. Mm -hmm. You've got a controlled birth. Uh, would some of us have been here, born to fill the earth? Yeah, but what's uh, Oh, how? Kenny Gale says, have, parli has pa have Parliament passed a law to limit couples and potential couples to a specific number of children? Say two per couple. Establishing a ministry won't work. Some of Ford says, anyway, I don't want to be Ghana's president. Never. But the little advice to the government is to set up a family of a ministry of family planning and distribution of this thing. What is the distance? <laughs> Thomas says, we don't need any more ministries, your news. People should stop suggesting names. Because Nanado is still not satisfied with the 110 ministries. And if he wants to add more, let's not give him the chance to create more financial burden on the state with an additional ministry. Seriously, you think that uh, by we posting this year, the president is just going to set up a ministry? <laughs> by German says, Ministry of Family Planning and Responsible Parenting. Okay, that sounds That's quite like it. James Abutanga says, Ministry of Gender will do, but controlling birth rates can be done without necessarily creating a ministry. Ibrahim says, Ministry of Media Kaba. Oh, how? <laughs> <laughs> Bernard Saba says, Ministry of Vasectomy at age 40. <laughs> Because most of men, most of the men about 40, are giving birth too much, especially to young ladies. You know, being says, uh, join news. I beg, don't let this man get um, um, <laughs> appetite for new ministry. And Peter says, JFM ministry. Anthony, ministry of population and reproduction. Judicial Sudo says, ministry of sex education. Jericho Kudan Suechan says, ministry of separation and sexification. I mean, but Missy, what do you make of the new uh, interface for Facebook? I think I like it. Yes, yes, yeah, it's, yes. Uh, it's clearer. Yeah, it's yeah. clearer. It's mm. a lot clearer. Mm. All right.